We have something really important we gotta do right now. It's very important. Come through my secret passageway. This is my Bobcat 337. It is old, it is Today's video is about excavators. I just like say things and then it's like, that's what the video is. Cause I don't have any plan. There's no, nothing was written. Not even ChatGPT could come up with this shit. Nobody would use this for any sort of reliable construction purposes, but me, I'm a moron. I bought it on Facebook Marketplace. These dudes put it on a trailer and they're towing it with like a big truck, like a pickup truck, but it wasn't anywhere near big enough that you think it should be. And it was like bouncing and flopping around the road and I for sure thought they were gonna crash. And they specifically went the way that there was not a way station because I'm pretty sure what we did was illegal, which was not paying a, the road tax for dragging a, a 13,000 pound vehicle down the freeway. Saved me money though, so I don't give a shit. Write me a script for a YouTube video of a mentally ill schizophrenic man who is a week away from putting on an event that will financially ruin him if it goes poorly. Please start, please start, please start. Oh, I didn't say what the actual problem was. Please start. Oh, and it's dead. It's dead, my baby. No, I can't say that. My job today is to get the uh, accurate TL into the back of that trailer. I have no idea how I did it. I think we have to start the excavator. I did some mods a couple months ago on the excavator so I could use it like a crane. See these hooks? I welded like a, like a quarter inch plate and then the hook onto it. And then we can hook the chain onto it and lift things. It's like not a good crane, but it's a crane nonetheless. In our CAD map of the venue that we had to submit to the government to get approval, there's a box that says art in the very front of open sauce, right where the line's gonna be when you come in. And we don't have any art to put there. So I gotta come up with something in like six hours. About two hours in, I was thinking, why not just bring the Acura TL up? That's art, right? This is art. Art! I am an artist. I am an artist. I am an artist. I am an artist. Don't tell me what I can't do. Don't tell me who I can't be. Anytime I use a piece of equipment here on the farm, maybe it cuts to like a, a shot of that. I don't know. Is that funny? I got to jump start it. I got to jump start it. One of my least favorite processes ever. Hey, everything I own, everything I own. Here I come, Acura TL. Papa has a surprise for you. He's taking you to San Francisco. The hardest yeah. part about using an excavator as a crane yeah. is it absolutely is not meant to be used as a crane. What happens is uh, the I can only extend forwards if I'm really low down. I don't know if that makes any sense. You'll see in a second. Do I just rip the engine out? I think I'm just gonna try to rip the engine out. I think I'm gonna try to rip the engine out. I'm gonna try to rip the engine out, I think. I think I'm gonna try to rip the engine out. I think I'm just gonna try to rip the engine Do out. Do I just rip the engine out? No, don't, don't, no, no, no. I'm gonna try to rip the engine out, I think. Did I get it? What, did I get the engine out? What, no, that was not the engine. Damn it. All right, up and away. Yes, it worked. I am an excavator god. I think I'm gonna try to rip the engine out. Get out! I am a Jiffy Loop mechanic. I am a professional. I know how to get the engine out of a car. This is how you do it. This is how they trained me. Get out, get out. My goal was to pull the engine out so we could, uh, there wouldn't be any fluids left in the car. And I, I don't know what I did. Sir, I have a very important question for you, sir. Have you ever been to Jiffy Lube before? No. Why not? Well, fuck your car up. Sir, 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 have you ever been to Jiffy Lube before? I have. You have? They fucked my car up. Excuse me, ma'am, excuse me. Have you ever been to Jiffy Lube before? Yeah, and they freaked my car up. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Have you ever taken your car to Jiffy Lube before? Maybe once or twice, but then you changed my oil for me. So I stopped having to go. Is that, is that it? Have you ever been to Jiffy Lube before? Yes. What happened to the car? They fucked my car up. How hard could it actually be to be a mechanic? I can't imagine very hard at all. And delicate and precise. I am a master of the excavator. Nobody is greater than me. I am excavator god. Yesterday I had diarrhea. And today, I also had diarrhea. Do we have any more beers? I can try to open a beer. 
All right, first step is to get the claw really close to it. I'm gonna come in at a super low angle, okay? And then I gotta get under the thumb, under the tab, and I don't know what to do. This just like doesn't want to come out. So I'm gonna get fired. I thought Jiffy Lube would be easy, but it's actually really hard. you uh, for three hours of labor. That's how long it took us to get the catalytic converter loose. No, that one? Is that the catalytic converter? Shit, man. I don't know why people take their stuff to get fixed elsewhere. Like, learn to fix it yourself. It's not hard. I mean, sometimes it's hard, but you never know till you get halfway through it. So just get halfway through it. Going to Da Vinci surgery robot mode. I'm a surgeon. I'm a brain surgeon. I'm a brain surgeon. I'm a brain... Shit! Did I do it? Did I open the can? I did. I opened the can, I did it. Ah, oh, man, work hard, reward hard. Oh my God, what the f am I saying? <laughs> you see this right here? This is my tractor. I called a shop and asked them how much money it would be for a tune-up. They told me $1,000. Guess what I did? I didn't fix anything. I and left it as is. Junior mechanic. I've been trying to change the oil for the past like two hours. Don't worry, we're billing the, the client hourly. That's how we do things here at Jiffy Lift. I'm gonna need you to cut the frame here. Okay, and then I'll we're gonna drag the engine out. Cut maybe this? this? Yeah, yeah, I'm thinking like right there. That's the important part. No, it's all what this part right here is doing is getting in the way of a Jiffy Lube oil change. You know what, you're right, what do I know? I just work here. Powerful tools get the job done fast. If you want your car fixed, full of oil, and totally fucked up, come on down to Jiffy Lube. Yeah! Don't fix it. Don't spend the money. Just drive it till it explodes. <laughs> Don't fix your shit. Just buy it old and crappy and then run it into the ground. Wait till it explodes. Seriously, I don't know why people buy new things. Just buy trash and then live with your trash. Piss your bed, don't wash the sheets. No, don't do that one. <laughs> um, got our engine removed. Our car is probably about 600 pounds lighter. All we have to do is figure out how to get it into the trailer. The first step is to put there's, I'm, what am I doing? I'm putting the car in the trailer. How do I, that's it, that's what I'm doing. I'm putting the car in the trailer. Um, the door is almost off already. You know how hard it was to put those wires in and how easy it was to rip them out. What? That's it! It's perfect! It's perfect! It's, oh my god, folding the front end actually made a difference. So the tires would be a foot off the edge if we hadn't folded the... Yeah, because I, I took the frame rails that were sticking out and I just like... <laughs> the Acura is coming to open sauce. If you want to see my 2005 Acura TL, you can buy your ticket right now at opensauce.com. Is that not a great sales pitch? All right, see you tomorrow. We're doing a video every single day till open sauce.